Hello everyone, we're gonna talk about Breaking Bad's finale. What a fucking episode. Oh, fuck, that was just, oh man. Let me start off by saying, like, Breaking Bad's a masterpiece. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck what you said. I don't give a fuck what I even say. It's a fucking masterpiece. It was. It was such a great oh, show. Like, I even, I didn't even like the show at first, though. Like, I got into it just last year. Like, it's pretty much the same. It, like, I got into it because a friend sent it to me, and, and she was like, you gotta watch this. You'll love it. And as soon as I saw the first episode with Walt in his underpants, I'm like, this is gonna be a good show. This, this is gonna be yeah. a good show. I started watching it because people wouldn't shut up about it, so I'm like, okay, I'm checking this out. And I understand why now. Oh, yeah, well, fuck, it was amazing. Yeah, that the was... acting, everything. So are you guys ready to look forward to uh, next week's episode? Because it's not going to fucking happen! Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm kind of pissed off of that. No more Breaking Bad, everyone. Oh. I'm still kind of upset. I'm still trying to absorb what the fuck happened. Like, I don't even know what happened, like internally with me i mean like i feel like i'm dying yeah it feels like part of like, my I, life i feel like my heart so went, <laughs> yeah boom meth started like popping out of me or some shit <laughs> okay let's actually <laughs> talk about the episode yeah right? like so so it began think? off in the car that was pretty intense really lucky for uh oh, well, for well, walt well remember like uh remember the the video where jesse took right he's like Oh yeah, Mr. Wolf the devil, he's fucking got, he's got luck and smartness on his yeah. side. There's the fucking bullshit luck, of course. No one, <laughs> who leaves their keys and, well, I guess, I don't know what back-ass fucking snowy shit place that was, like, fucking Canada Somewhere in New remake. Hampshire. <laughs> yeah, it was in New Hampshire, but like. So yeah, no, that, yeah. You might think it's Canada. I just thought that was really lucky. But, I, yeah, I'd say like, it's probably the most, that's over. probably the most, like, Finish your sentence, come on. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Let's, let's work this out together, come on. What your sentence? It's like the most, like, <laughs> impossible situation. Like, the most, unpre no, the most unlikely, I'm gonna say. Well, like, remember, early, if, if you guys remember, where did Walt used to hide his keys? Under his fucking car yeah. fucking thing. Who yeah. does this? Who, who fucking does that? Like, I don't put my keys out of my, I, I'm like every other fucking normal, like, mine is in, like, this leaf shit in my house, like. I don't even know what that is. Like some fucking container of leaves with keys in them. That's where my I take my keys and go, <laughs> fucking there. I know it's there. I don't have to go underneath the car and just like. <sniffs> but yeah, so like it starts off in the car. It's all fucking snowy. He's dipping from the fucking bar. For it was the last intense night. though. And then he's going out for revenge. We all I I knew they were going. He was going out to kill fucking Uncle Bitch and Todd Fuck. And Jesse was kind of an iffy. Like at first when the episode started, I'm like. He's gonna go after Jesse as well. Then, then once the later on, I'm like, yeah. you know what? I, I don't think he's going to. I think he's gonna save his ass because you know they have like a little gay relationship. Yeah, well, considering like Walt put the hit on Jesse and he wanted him dead. Like how many episodes? Like three episodes. Fuck. And then so Hank's dead. Gomi's dead. We lost like all the Mexican viewers after he died. So like, <laughs> <laughs> still got one right here. So like. Gomi was funny because he was like that random Spanish guy because he's in, this takes place in New Mexico. So yeah, was... but yeah, like if you, I don't even know why I'm saying if you haven't seen the show, you're probably watching this because you fucking have. If you haven't, just just stop watching this literally right now and go fucking watch the damn fucking show. Yeah. I am not fucking kidding with you. I'll fucking swear fucking five more fucking times. Fuck, fuck, fuck you, fuck, fuck. Nice. Yeah. This is. So, the uh, the gray matter um, partners Gretchen and what's his name Lydia no who? Gretchen and Gretchen and who like the what are you talking about gray matter remember like the laser pointers and give the money to my fucking family who oh um remember fuck uh you broke into like their yeah house. they're fucking yeah. the skinny white bitch who can't do shit she lets <laughs> old fucking fifty year old man come into his house and stick them up with like little led lasers yeah i knew that was a fake i'm just like nah, yeah i called that too like you can't like he's not gonna hire anyone like that but i think i laughed more than <laughs> it was still a good <laughs> no scene. but it was it was because you thought it might be like some random kids but it was funny because it was fucking uh badger and little mini mexican oh i don't fucking know his name do you know his name i can't remember but yeah like that final episode was like fuck and like 
that scene where he's out in the desert setting up the uh, fucking like the machine gun and shit. I'm like, I'm like, I know what's gonna happen right as soon as I saw that. I'm like, he's gonna pull up and he's gonna just fucking unleash hell on them. And especially I, with that clicker with the the car alarm, I'm like, that's that's the key right there. I honestly thought he was gonna pull like a twist and metal and like, get in the car and start shooting up people. <laughs> I was like, we should no. play twist and metal, but that's that, that's a, that's a, that's another another time. Twist like, metal's fun. Like right when he when he was inside that uh, what was it what was it called like the safe house no the fun house or fun house yeah where everyone got shot oh and the, yeah that's their like little safe house base shit yeah um like when he was driving to park the car yeah yeah I kind of I I kind of got it there that he was that lining he was gonna, it up yeah like yeah. once I saw him like, as soon as I, I saw him turning he's like uh, I'm like yeah of course he's gonna line up he's gonna have to turn the car a specific way. Cause I, cause he set it up so it was like that spray fire, but, and then you didn't believe me because we watched this together. Like we, we decided to fucking, yeah. sh you're fucking coming home. We're finishing off this shit. And we're gonna cry and like, ah! but no, like <laughs> seriously. But um, we fucking watched it. And I'm, he's like, Josh, he was just like, he didn't get hit. Walt didn't get hit. I fully saw his ass get hit. His body jumped like he was like, yeah. I, I like think, I think I didn't want to believe if, it. If uh, if I like to put in words of Forrest Gump. It's like something came up and bit me in the butt talks, but it bit him in the side. Forrest Gump is well, funny, but yeah. Close enough. <laughs> that dive for Jesse was fucking epic, though. That was oh. probably one of my favorite moments like, in Breaking Bad. Oh, I, I loved how Jesse, yeah. like how he died for him, that was emotionally like satisfying, but what was more was how he strangled the fuck out of Todd. I was just like... Yeah, that bit... That like, like, he's... He was just fucking creepy. It's, it's not that he was bad. I don't think he's mentally... Like, there's something mentally wrong. Yeah, definitely. But, like, I mean, like... I don't think he had, like, a ba bad intentions. Like, mm -hmm. he was just... Todd. He's just that way. Like, honestly, it's just... It's, it's just Todd. I, I have no... You, you can't really say it's Todd. It's Todd and the light just died. Well, hopefully you guys can still see us. Yeah. But, yeah, like... Fuck, it's just... <sighs> like, well, like, when he killed Todd, it was like, fucker deserved it. I fucking hated Todd. I never liked Todd from the beginning. Like, a lot of... I have actually, like, have a lot of friends who are like, Todd's actually pretty cool. I'm like, fuck Todd. Todd's a bitch. Like, <laughs> especially once he killed the kid, I'm just like, no, Todd's a fucking... He should fucking just die. He's just... Yeah. He just doesn't know jack shit all, so he just yeah. he just pissed me off. Oh yeah, it was really funny. You know the guy that was in the recliner, right? You know Walt actually waited the fire until he was up on it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That and was that funny. Was the guy so was fucking funny. around. And the guy's like dead, just going up. And He's down. still going up and down. So epic. And how he killed Uncle Jack. Yeah. Just like I mean, how he killed Hank. Or what was it like? Yeah. Yeah. No, he's just like, I got money. I got money. I can go. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I took my money, I need to find it on my own, I don't even need it. <coughs> yeah. But like the most heartbreaking part for me probably was that part where Jesse's about to get in the car and Walt just nods. He's just like You know. Yeah. Exactly. Mm hmm We we uh, you know what I'm talking about, Jesse. Just Yeah. And then once Jesse drives off, he goes off into the need for speed. That's how that movie starts off. Nice. Fuck that. Great show, great episode, <sighs> great everything. Amazing series. If you guys haven't checked wait, it out and you're watching this wait, video for wait. some fucking reason. What's happening with Brock? The little fucking Mexican kid. Well, he's probably going to be sent he's gonna be the relatives. No, he's going to be the new cook. He's going to be the new Walter Mexican White. <laughs> Instead of Walter White, he's going to be Walter Mexican. <laughs>